What is going on guys? So today I was planning on doing a little bit of underwater camera action oh, But then I realized once I got to the water that um, My underwater case for my GoPro doesn't fit. I thought they were universal. I thought wrong You know so We'll definitely have to go get a uh, an underwater case that fits my GoPro Good to know that I bought the wrong case. I didn't know there was a difference. That's kind of irritating, but uh, hey, you live and learn, right? You live and learn. So today, we're playing around with the logic baits again. And uh, let's see what we're gonna use. Pretty sure, pretty sure we're gonna use the worm again because um, I really, really like the worm. There she is. Bam, 10 inch worm. Cannot go wrong with a 10 inch worm. You can catch little fish, you can catch big fish, and you can catch monster fish. And that's what we want is them monsters. So the girl is throwing a uh, drop shot yum dinger because uh, that is the tried and true lure for this pond. So she thinks she's gonna outfish me today with that. I know I'm gonna I think she's wrong. Man, I can't even see the camera, so I hope you guys can see. Hope it's on. I think I hit the button. <laughs> that would suck. I didn't even see that duck right there on the shoreline. I did. I was gonna say, but it was a cute recording. He doesn't care about the cute duck. No, I don't. It's a teal, though. It's a cute and tasty duck. Its feet are so Remember, there's grass right over here. Don't hit the boat, obviously, because boats fight. Boats fight harder than most fish. Let me get you guys a look where I'm looking. Oh, that's a fishy. Oh, that's a fishy. Take it. He's just a little guy, though. We'll set it. See what we do. Oh yeah. Oh, I said it was a little guy. He's not terrible. Yes, sir. First fish on the, and he flopped the hook. Damn. Well, you guys saw that. We got one on the logic space. We won't count it though, because it was not in the boat and I do not count a fish. It doesn't count if it's not in the boat. Yeah, if it didn't get in the boat, it does not count. I will live by that rule. The bait held up though, it didn't even rip. I didn't set that hook very hard. I thought he was a little guy. I thought he was a little baby. He was barely even hitting it. You got him. A little guy, pull him in so you don't lose a dinger. So she got the first fish of the day. Just a wee little dinger on a dinger. <laughs> was like, was like nice a, little guy. Weeds on the end of that. And the weeds are fighting. <laughs> that hook was barely hooked too. What do we got? All uh, about 10 inches. It's good first fish of the day though. I'll tell you what. There he goes. I told you that I could smell the fish. <laughs> Yeah, it didn't even feel like there was a fish there. It felt like grass. Didn't look like it. <laughs> it was like, I'm pulling in some grass, and I was like, I'm just going to set it just for fun. <laughs> He flopped it right there too. What a little. Oh, that's a fish. Oh yeah. See if I can land this one, eh? Yes. 
finally I get a fish in the boat. Jeez, I'm gonna break my tip. Hold on. You want me to get a picture too? I really don't. Too much? Yeah, go for it. Give something to put on Instagram later. Yeah. Turn it so it be the worm is for me. Hey. Hey, the worm blends in with the fish, so. <laughs> Hold on, let me get that worm. Ow! Pricked myself, boys and girls. That hurt. They're staring right down his throat. <laughs> you like that? As you can see, it's... She's in there. They're swallowing them today. Go. Well, it took me a second to figure out if that was a fish or not. What we'll do for you logic spores, we'll hang that right there so the boys can see. There we go. Yeah. Oh, not a bad fishy. How are we doing? Good to go? Yeah, smile. You're good. I forget to smile. <laughs> we'll get it on video. Look at that right there. That's what she is right there. 10 inch reaper worm. Thank you very much, Logix, for another sweet bait. That's probably the best fish I'm gonna catch all day. He's actually a pretty good size fish. Little cove right here. And uh, he didn't want any part of me at all. He just gone. The second he looked at the water, he was gone. Some of them here, a, lo a lot of them, they jump back up in the water and just Oh yeah, they like to dance. Let me get over here in the grass though, so I can fix my rod. Cause I got a mess going on. Huh? I cast perfectly, so I'm letting that line. I was gonna say, just let out line. <laughs> That's a rock, I only hit that rock. Oh. Hold on to your britches. Oh, yeah. Alrighty. Here we go, boys and girls. First fish landed with one of the Logix baits. Now, normally, because I'm trying to do a review on them, I would switch it up. And you know what? I wasn't gonna switch it up, but I will. So we got one on the green. Not really once you realize Reaper. Right. Let's uh, let's try. The red. Yeah, let's try a red. Well, we'll try a freaky beaver. See if they like the beavers today, cause I just like the their worms because they're chunky worms. Yeah, they're like they're thick. Like my pinky is the size. Of they're them. nice worms. I love the worms. That's why I've been throwing that one, cause uh, it's definitely so, oh, money. Something that's a good size has to swallow that. A little baby one's not gonna go for that. So big. You're brave if you go for a worm that's in my pinky. So. A tangled up mess here. There we go. Oh, got him. Wow. <laughs> he's a deep diver. Is he? At least he's staying down. I like that. Yeah, 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 yeah. He's a fuck. Feisty little guy. There he <laughs> Look is. At him. He comes out of the there he is. Finds out. <laughs> Another one with a dinger. Look, dude, barely hooked. Did you guys? You guys? No, you didn't see that because I had it up too high. I, that was barely hooked I in there. I was about to pull in, in from the water. That's not the little fishy. What's that make? Three on one. Three on one. She's smoking me, boys. <laughs> Some days I do. Some days smoking I do. me. Like I said this morning, she wasn't gonna beat me, and then she's beating me. I know that logic's real. That's got um, trailing. 14 pound fluorocarbon on it, I believe. That, and that thing casts like butter. I mean, this this casts great, and that Abu Garcia Black Max casts great, but. That one. Yeah, that Logix Expert casting reel with a left hand retrieve on it. You can get them in right hand retrieve, but I wanted to get one in uh, left hand because I've never tried it until I tried that one. And wow, yeah, she likes it, I like it. It's great for flipping. Um, it's like I said, cast like butter. She is smooth. I, I don't use left or I don't use left hand, and I don't use bait caster, but I'll use that. Yeah. <laughs> and the best part about that is, with my promo code, you get a fifteen percent off. Wink, wink. Little hint, hint there. <laughs> subtle hint. That was a subtle hint. It wasn't very subtle, but it was a subtle hint.
I get crap. Come on. Come on. Oh. I landed that right on my tip of my other rod. Oh, did you just hear that? Did you guys just hear that? There's a fish. There's fish. Right off of that log right there. Nice one to end the video on. Let's get him in the boat. Bazinga. So we got to fish in the boat. That's always good. I always like it when that happens. Doesn't happen much. We're gonna drop this because uh, I don't wanna go too far. Come here, you. There we go. On the freaky beaver in red. It works. There's the proof. Proof is in the fish, not in the pudding like usual. Woman? Would you like to take a picture for me so I can show the boys at Logic that they work? Hopefully. Not that they don't already trust me. Hopefully no one bites me. You little bastard. Um, There's a proof for you guys. That's what it is right there. Now the Logic's bait getting it done. Alright guys, so I figured I'd do a little outro for this video because uh, like you guys probably noticed my camera died on the water. Um, we did get one more fish. One more. We only fished for about 20-30 more minutes um, and I caught a nice one. It'll be a 16 incher off of that red freaky beaver. Um, I kept throwing it after I caught that one fish at the end there and uh, I did snag that one. It was probably a 16 inch. I want to say it was right around a pound and a half, maybe two pounds. Um, then we packed it up and we called it it because I wanted to get editing that video and I had some other stuff to do today. But I wanted to show you guys a little bit of a close up because you um, guys really didn't get to see much on the water. Or if you did, at least I want to show you a little bit more. So this is that freaky beaver I was throwing. Logic Spades freaky beaver. Really, really sweet bait. I love these ribs. They give it a hell of an action. Um, and my favorite, favorite part about this is when you Texas rig it, it sits down in the water like this and the tails actually kind of float up into the water um so when you when you're just jigging it it the tails flop around a little bit and that's that's a great action that is that is a great action they, they did an awesome job with this bait most of the time the baits that i use when they hit the bottom they just sink they sink right to the bottom that's not bad i mean you're still going to get an action pulling it across the bottom but when they sit on the bottom and you can just jiggle them a little bit and they move around, golly, does that get some hits. Um, so I do love that Freaky Beaver. That's that's great. It's great stuff right there. But as you saw in the first one, I was throwing this, a 10-inch Reaper. If I can get it to finagle here. 10-inch Reaper, green. Uh, I get the first one off of this one, and then I packed it up and I moved to the Beaver. But, uh, wow, do I love their worms. I want to say right now, Logic, you guys have the best curly tail worm that I have used because of, one, the size. I did catch the one fish off of here. I hooked them. three of them, four of them that I didn't get in the boat total all day. Um, I did throw this one on the other day, and I hooked, like, four fish. But uh, I was fishing the power station. I don't know if you follow me on Instagram, but I was fishing a power station. You guys probably saw that picture. It's like a 20 foot drop. And um, as you saw in the beginning of the video, I just couldn't get the hook set. You know, I don't, I don't know why. I don't know what the hell was going on. I don't blame this bait at all. I blame the hooks. I actually switched the hooks like halfway through the video um, to a completely different one because I was trying out some hooks and blah, 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 whatever. Hooks, hooks, hooks. But. I want to say great job logics on these uh, soft plastics I have used the craw the craw also stands up perfect like the uh, the freaky beaver but we didn't get around to using it today in the video I will make sure to get another video um, going on I got a bunch of other logic space that I gotta show you check out my unboxing so you can see all the ones that I bought and um, I think I got some divers I got uh, lipless crankbait that I want to throw but I'm not really a big hard bait guy. I really love soft plastics. That's why I got so many different soft plastics from Logic Baits. But uh, I do want to say great baits, nice, thick, hard baits. And uh, like I said, they float. They don't float, par se, but when they sit in the water like this and you can jiggle them, golly, does that get the fish 
going. You know what I mean? So uh, do me a favor. Go over to Logic Spades on YouTube. Give, uh, give them a subscribe. Check out the channel. They got one video. Hopefully, we'll get some more up. If I can figure out how to get my videos to them, hopefully, uh, they get around to putting them on their site because um, I'd like to see them uh, with some more videos. You know what I mean? But also, give me a subscribe if you would because I do appreciate it very much. And uh, go over on Instagram. If you don't have an Instagram, you should definitely make one because uh, it's 2018. Instagram is, uh, is, is good stuff. Good stuff. But uh, follow me at Fishing Fanatic 207. Go over there and look at Logic underscore Bates. Go give them a follow. Uh, give them some likes. Show them some love because they are a great company. I mean, they just came out with these baits. Oh, what they say. Was it three weeks ago, four weeks ago? They were going to release them. They released them about a week ago. I got them in two days. Two days. And I was fishing with them in three days. And we're already catching fish with them. And... Let me tell you right now, they work like a charm. So I can tell you, hands on, these plastics, great plastics. Um, I will definitely say that their other baits look great in the water. Uh, the girlfriend used them a little bit. I haven't particularly thrown any of them because, like I said, I'm not a hard bait guy. But uh, I definitely want to say, good job. Good job, Logic. You guys got some sweet baits. And uh, definitely make sure that you guys go and follow them on Instagram and YouTube. And uh, do the same for me if you would because I do appreciate it and we'll get some more videos out there. But uh, let me know what you think of the Logic Spates. Go onto their site and check them out. Drop a comment down below, down down there. Uh, let me know what you think is the best Logic Spate and which one you want me to try next because I got most of them. I got most of their jigs. I think I got all their jigs in every different color. Uh, I got their Deep Divers. I got their, um, I don't know what they call it. I got their Lipless crankbait and i also got the craws and the soft plastics and i got uh, the red and green in these and i got the red and green in these so uh definitely drop a comment down below tell me what you want me to do for my next video it's probably going to be logics based because i have so many baits to try out from them and uh it's definitely going to take up the next couple probably two three videos so definitely tune in to see those go back see my unboxing that i did the other day so you can check out all the ones i have I do appreciate you guys watching this video and uh, try to drop a like maybe, maybe. Drop that comment like I asked and uh, subscribe if you like the channel because uh, we're going to keep this ball rolling. We're just going to keep it going. I finally got my GoPro now so we are getting there. You know, we're not, we're not professional. We ain't professional yet. But we're getting there. We are getting there. I would like to blow up. Let's get it. Let's get it. You know what I mean? Bam. Let's get it.